Would you like to know how to define your own command in LaTeX or in other words your own macro in LaTeX? Keep watching this video up to then. In this video I'm going to talk about how to uh, define your own command and I exemplify this uh, this point with some uh, examples and I talked about different forms of defining a uh, new command in later. Keep watching. Hey guys, welcome back to the Master Your Academic Skill channel. If you have not subscribed to this channel, be sure to subscribe my channel and click on the bell ring to get notified when my new videos are uploaded. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to define your own command in LaTeX and discuss about a uh, different form of uh, defining your own command. All right, now it's time to talk about making your own commands. Okay, you know, if you, if you are frequently using the same term in your command, uh, uh, obviously it would be annoying that um, to type in, to type it again and again and again may, for many times. Okay. Uh, in uh, LaTeX, there, there is a nice property that you can define your own command, uh, which is also called uh, a macro. Okay, you can find you can define your your own command, and it has a definition, it has a name for recalling, and when you use that command, okay, the the definition you propose in the command will be compiled. Okay. And you know, no matter in the text body you, you are defining the uh, your own command or you want to define it into into the preamble part, it can be used for the ty type setting of your own text or in the type setting of uh, the formula. Okay, it is practical for on both of these cases. Now let me show you what is the simplest form of definition of new command okay new command new command okay this is you see this is the simplest form of defi defining your own command or a, a macro or a new command then there are two braces here you see there are two braces here the first bra brace uh, which is uh, which is written in uh, cmd this uh, here you have to define the name of your command. For example, I like to um, use an abbreviation. For example, um, tr. Okay, I, I I'm going uh, to use a backslash tr command, uh, which uh, which stands for try angular. Okay. For example, uh, I have a text, and the triangular word is very very frequent in this uh, text uh, let me show you how to use this command this is a triangular let me first uh, compile this text to see what is happening okay you see you see that uh, here is my text this is a tri triangular okay uh, if i remove this word and use tr and once again if i compile it you see the con uh, instead of tr command the triangular word is compiled this is how how we use a, a new command for an abbreviation in uh, our text uh, another another example let me uh, type another uh, sentence uh, for example a circle is not the same as tr let me compile this sentence to, s to show you that you see at the end of the, this sentence I have a triangular while uh, in the main body of my text I have the command of TR which stands for triangular this is uh, this is a, a general form of using new command in the text file another form of using command is 
uh, uh, you may define your, your own command but it has some uh, arguments for example I like to show uh, some uh, some specific force in a BF in a bold phase or uh, in fact I'm uh, I should using uh, I should be using the BF series phone okay uh, for example uh, I like to important okay this is the name of import important important is my command that uh, this command has one argument to one argument okay in the uh, see, in the in the bracket i have to input the number of uh, arguments that i i needed in my new in my new command and in the definition uh, i use it i i define my command like text bf text text b f yes text bf and number symbol or sharp one okay without space okay <clears throat> the second one so the second one is a general form of a, a new command with uh, with some argument that in this case i have one uh, i have one argument let me give you an example for example uh, suppose <laughs> suppose uh, i want to emphasize on the not word okay so in fact it is a uh, it is a, an important word for me and i like to use my command important you see the important uh, needs one argument in fact the argument should be the word and when i put it the command uh, the not in the command and if I compile it, you see not is compiled in a bold form or bold face. Okay, that's uh, that's uh, that is how uh, my new commands important is working. You may increase the number of uh, argument in your command. Only the the if you want to do this, you have to increase the number of uh, the argument here in the bracket and uh, you put you should put the uh, argue your argument in the appropriate by uh, typing number symbol or sharp and the number of uh, argument for example num uh, argument number one should be here argument number two should be here uh, or um, argument number three should be here and you can um, you can make it clear where the uh, the, where the uh, the certain argument should be placed there. This is a this is a general form of uh, using new command with uh, some arguments. Another case of uh, defining new command is, uh, for example, is is the case that your command have some optional arguments. Okay, let me give you uh, an example for this case for example i have uh, i'm gonna modify modify my new command important uh, i mean it has two arguments and uh, the optional part is bf series okay bf series and the arguments are used number one number two okay what is happening here is that uh, when I have an optional optional part here, it means that if this is pre this is present, then the first argument would be optional, okay, with a default value which is given here. Uh, otherwise, all arguments are mandatory. Let me give you an example. For example, uh, let's uh, compile first this part. Okay, you see the all of the uh, all of the these uh, tags are compiled uh, in are compiled in a BF series, but uh, uh, oh, let me put it into the races. Yes, yeah. Now if I compile it, yeah, this is right. Uh, when I put it into the 
uh, into the braces I have uh, I have only not in a bold face okay but I like to uh, compile the same word okay the same word in an italic shape using the important command so I have to use this command as you see that the first uh, argument is optional for example I like to compile the uh, the same word as italic shape italic shape yes italic shape and uh, when I put the italic shape here um, when I compile it you see the same is compiled in an italic form it means that the uh, in this in this case the in this case of using the important command uh, its shape uh, its shape command uh, is replaced by the uh, replaced by uh, instead of instead of the bf series this is how that um, the command uh, the new command uh, is used with uh, some optional arguments and this is enough for this part uh, in fact in, in the defining of macro or uh, command uh, it would be enough for the this part and uh, it has a very very applications for the type setting formula that uh, when I uh, when I teach uh, the type setting of formula, I will show again how to use uh, the new commands there. That's it. If you like this video, give a thumbs up to this video and be sure to subscribe my channel. If you have any question, please feel free leave a comment below. And thank you for watching. See you soon.